Hello, it's Romer, also known as Calvin, and this is The Legend of Zelda The Phantom Hourglass, and this is Link's Great Voyage, and we're all gonna go on it together, and we're gonna have fun, and we're not gonna call it Wind Waker 2, like I did last time. Um, also, by the way, I got a suggestion from someone to get a Discord, I don't really know what it is, I set it up, um, it's gonna be in the description, there, what, what you can do there, it's gonna be used for updates, so don't have to upload a video every time something happens. But also, if you want to suggest a game, or if you want to suggest something to do in a game, or if you want to give any pointers in the game, that's a perfect place to do it, and I will be looking at it daily, uh, once a day or so, if that makes sense. Uh, so let's go back into this Temple of the Ocean King. I did the first part again because it didn't really matter, but also I will say it wasn't that bad redoing it. Okay, so we have this to do. What are they? Ooh, eyeball monsters. Allow me to explain, those are phantom eyes. They act as extra eyes for the phantom if one sees you. Yeah, what happens if one sees you? The phantoms will find you, and then it only gets worse, so be cautious. However, unlike the phantoms, the these creatures can be defeated. Find them on the map. I get it. So you have to find a way to hit them before they see you. Come on, let's go into the safe zone, see you, Link. Okay, so we have... There is a great worry. That comes with this game. I forget what I was talking about as well. That I'm gonna fail really badly. So, it says find them on the map, they're right there. I'm guessing we have to hit the boomerang against them. Or maybe throw a bomb at them, it's one or the other. But yeah, it wasn't that bad going back through, through this again because they actually gave a lot of shortcuts. Which is really cool. That's not gonna work. I suppose I could go down here. It's not gonna matter because we can't get through here because of the gust. I wonder how we stop this. Short answer is we can't and we only have seven minutes to do this. Well actually a little bit longer because we're gonna find some extra stuff to do it in. Oh wait, right here. Oh, so every time they, they spot me, it adds another one of those things. Okay, that's fair enough. That's... That's real punishment enough, actually. That's a real punishment. Okay, so now that we're down here, though... I wonder. I wonder, can we kill them, though? I'm not quite sure where to go, though. So it is very possible to kill these guys. That, oh, that stops the gust? No. The gust is still going. Um. Okay, we'd wait for this guy. I'm gonna wait for this guy to come back down because I'm not gonna do this without him down here. Well, maybe actually we don't need to. We hit this one. It's a bit awkward. You know, I'd feel more comfortable knocking this guy out first, or killing this guy first. I'd feel way more comfortable. Okay, let's see what we can do. Oh, my lord. But it seems like the other guy's gone ever since I killed the guy. Like, killed the little creature attached to it. Which is cool. That means we won't get overwhelmed if we're good enough to be able to stop them. Hmm. Seems like a lot to do, though. I'm hoping that I can do this in five minutes, which I probably can't.
How did that not notify you guys of my whereabouts? Well, because it opens up that. Okay, okay, let's let this guy walk by. Maybe he won't come in here. Actually, I'm pretty sure he can come in here, can he? No, I can't. Because he's a freaking idiot. Now we get the key. Which, there's there's two locked doors. Um, there's one down there and there's one up there. We can only reach one of the locked doors right now, actually, so... Let's be smart about this. Hope you guys are feeling good, by the way, today. I'm feeling pretty good myself. Uh, Easter holidays. I don't know if you guys get Easter holidays, but Easter are basically like a second midterm, but it's gonna be like two weeks off. Oh, this is weird. We're like on a completely different floor. Well, we have to go down here, so I don't know why I went back up. I think I can do this in five minutes? Okay, we can't do that. I guess you have to go up here. Someone's gonna stop us. Okay, I'm gonna look down the game head for a bit. Oh. That wasn't so bad. That could've been way worse. I think it was only an extra 15, was it? Well, I guess they're, they're, um... They're looking at it as an estimate true that how long you would've stayed there. Like, they gave me back 15 seconds because they assumed that it wouldn't take more than 15 seconds to defeat them? Hopefully that's the case. I was talking about it, like, in the other video, but since that video didn't get uploaded because of what happened... I was talking about a very good show I'm watching called Chit Well Watched. I finished it. Children of the Whales. Got a red potion. That's actually pretty good. That's actually too good. What the fuck is this? I guess we have to stop it somehow. Is that going- does that start when I come over? It does. No, does it? How- I guess we have to go up? Or down, I should say? Oh my god. We have to do this, though. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I know it's just a little further. I know what, you I know what you're talking about. Oh my god, leave me alone. What does it say? Before you lies the second tablet governing the crest. We actually have to stun them first. I don't think we can just kill them. Which is unfortunate. I like just killing things. A single stroke draws sacred tries to reveal the path. Okay, I think I have this. I'm not exactly sure. Is that correct? Good. Okay, that took a big f bit of figuring out. A bit. Wait, we where we need where we need to go? Oh, there's the sun thing again. 
There's no way we're done here already, though, are we? We might just be. Press the sacred crest against the sea chart to transfer it. That was a really weird way of doing a puzzle. I didn't know what to do and I looked it up and they said that you had to like close your Nintendo 2DS or your DS. Uh, so I tried putting it into this mode. Which is just a virtual console menu, which by the way is the best menu ever. And there we did it. Okay, wow Link, you figured out what it meant by pressing them together. <laughs> the crest is here. Oh, so we're right in the middle of the map. I hate to say it, but maybe we should uh, go ask Linebeck what he thinks. Maybe we should. Okay, that wasn't so bad. That was actually really fun. I'm imagining that, like... It's probably gonna get less fun as time goes on, though, because I don't know if I could do that first part again and again and again and again. In fact, that would be kind of irritating. <laughs> we might as well go talk to Linebeck anyway. We have a lot of stuff, so we should buy another red potion as well. We should do a lot of things. Excuse me? I've actually been playing Fortnite as well recently, um, because my friends play it. And like, I'm, I'm, get, I'm getting kind of into it. I probably said that already, but I'm getting a little bit into it, you know? Skip the mail. Sorry. What do you gotta do, Lambic? Well, look what the crab dragged in. Get that third sea chart yet? We found a secret mark that it tr we transferred to our southwestern chart. And we found out that the Temple of Courage will open with a sun key. I bet that new mark on our chart reveals a spot that's essential to our quest. I see. And since seeing you is believing, it's time for you to believe in old Linebeck. I say that we go there. We're bound to find something. Let's go. The climb aboard the open sea calls. I bet it does, Linebeck. The other guy's like, I, I asked you for help. <laughs> Just a little bit of help, kid? It's kind of weird that every single, um... Every single individual asks uh, Link for help. I mean, it's probably pretty simple to get get help for yourself, you know? Unless they know that I'm like a hero. I guess like the green outfit is kind of probably maybe a symbol for being a hero. And this is the, I guess, if Link is the same Link from Wind Waker, then it would make 100% sense that they're asking for help from him. Right? Well, I guess, no, it's a different world. Ah, oh, okay. There's nothing that looks like a crest anyway, just a bunch of sea. Well, maybe there's something at the bottom of the sea. Don't look at me, I'm crazy, but maybe it's down under the sea, but I'm not getting wet, kid. I can't even swim. Um... Let's go to Cannon Island, because he did say he was working on a salvage arm. So, like, we could go back to him and maybe he'll give us, like, a... What's what you see? Oh god, I didn't even see that coming. So maybe he'll, if we go there, he'll actually give us something to actually, like, pick it up out of the, the ground. And then it might, be, might, it might be the sun crest, actually. It's gone pretty smoothly. I've actually been enjoying this game quite a bit. And we're almost close to, like, the third dungeon, so... It's gone by very quickly. Okay, we, I guess we can just go straight up to him. Oh, special delivery. He's gonna tell us our mail. This letter from Edo of Cannon Island. Ahem. Oh, he's probably gonna tell us about the thing. <laughs> hey, you Link, I've got some very big news. Big, big news. See, I've been working on a salvage arm for a long time, but now it's ready. This gorgeous piece of machinery lets us pull up treasure from the sea floor. I'm gonna sell this thing to the first one who gets here. Ready, set, sail? Who's gonna be the lucky customer to claim it? It's gonna be me. And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir? Then I'm out of here. It's gonna be me. I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna be the one to buy it. I'm gonna be, yeah, sorry about not doing my voices that I usually do. Um, I have a chest infection. <laughs> I, I caught it from, uh, two nefs. Yes, yes, it's finally complete. The salvage arm will let you reach the bottom of the sea for sunken treasure. What? Aren't you simply you aren't you the simply bought the cannon from me? I only want a salvage arm. <clears throat> oh God, excuse me. 
Did you come racing over here after getting one of my letters? You dropped everything to rush here for my invention. Yeah, I'm a real fan of your work, I guess. Butter me up is all you want. Butter me up all you want, but it's gonna cost you big time. Again, I'm sorry, I'm gonna, I can't do it right now. My chest is really sore. Show me how much you want to salvage on. Show me some gusto. Wait, what? I will decide your price based on that. Okay, go. Oh, sorry. Okay, I have to shout. I have to shout into the mic. <laughs> now those are some pipes. No complaints here. Well, I'll set aside for two hundred rupees. That is a deal. Still walk around with a bunch of rupees, eh? Yeah, I'm. I'm actually very stupid. I don't do that in real life. Doesn't surprise me one bit. Okay, take it then. The salvage arm is yours. Very cool. You got the salvage arm, now you can pull treasures up on the sea floor. This is very useful and Wind Waker is probably going to be very useful here. Open your menu while... Okay, I know how to do it. But we probably have to go back to the island to attach it, don't we? Like, there's no way... We... By the way, I didn't want to do it too loud because, again, I couldn't probably shout very loud. So what I did is I just put my mouth around the mic and made that really, like, low guttural sound that makes no sound really outside of the thing. But makes a lot of sound... Like, on the mic. Yes, please. Okay, so we're actually making some good progress here. Some very good progress. The word progress kind of annoys me this sometimes. <laughs> so we have to go back to this island here so we can actually go and... There's also treasure, so we should probably get that treasure as well. Oh, I just shot at some birds. Wait, it's just there? Or is it, or is it already... Wait, what, let's stop. We shot the frog. Oh, nice set, buddy. The big frog spread the word about you. So want to know what to draw in the second stage player? Okay, I have to learn it to fly. Okay, so pay attention. He's going to show us a sign. So it's like an upside down hourglass without the top. I'll remember that. Hey, you better write it down somewhere. Yes, I'll remember. Then I'm out of here. If you see my fellow frogs, give them my best. Ribbit. Thanks. Man, it's pissed me off because I love. Oh man. Wait. Oh, I can just salvage. I can just salvage. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually gonna go get the treasure first. And then in the next one, we're gonna like just get we're gonna just, just gonna get this treasure to see what it is. And in the next one, we're actually gonna start off by actually getting the uh, whatever. Maybe I think it might be the sun crest. It makes sense. Man, it's really fun going on the open sea though. It's really cool. And I promise, by the way, I, I should be better for the next episode. I've been sick for the past couple of episodes. Not sick, but you know, had a bad throat. Oh, I tried to jump, but I guess I didn't. I did it too late. Should we? St we should stop right above the X. Okay, so I think I know how to salvage it. Like, so we can go down faster like that. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh shit. This shouldn't be too difficult, but like, uh, you knowing me, guys, you know me. I'm gonna make it difficult. If we, if we take a little bit slowly, slower and like not worry about these rupees too much. Oh crap, okay, we have some life. Oh shit, I'm going too fast. So we caught it. Do we have to bring it back up? 
Okay, guys, I'm gonna look at the gamepad for this. Shit. Oh, God. This is actually so nerve-wracking. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm honest to God like this with exams as well and like essays. I I think I do better under pressure when there's like no time left, I have no lives left. I think it's when I do best. <laughs> okay. We got a big chest, whatever it is. One minute oh that's really good. Alright guys, so in the next one we're gonna go to the other treasure point and also go to this as well and then um if that's actually very worth it to actually, like, go, I guess, to... And, like, we can do this now, right, can we? So we can just fast travel to a place? That's perfect. We don't even have to go that far down. Alright, guys, that's, that was very fun. I had very fun, a lot of fun doing that. I think the Ocean King uh, temple isn't that bad. And I'm actually going to set a route. Not true a rock. And in the next one, we will get there. Thank you for watching, guys. And I'm sorry for again for um, kind of being... Kind of being wrong with the throat. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a rest. And it should be fine by then. And I'm also sorry about what happened with Minish Cap. Uh, that's a load of bullshit. But it happened. Come.